Wow, ik ben zo blij. Ik ben zo blij. Ik ben zo Boom! Today I'm with Christine. <laughs> How are you supposed to hold this thing? Okay, y'all. So today we are in the car. This is my first time driving here in the Netherlands. I have an appointment to go model for a girl. She's going to do my makeup. And I um, have to travel like one hour and something with public transportation so i chose to rent out a car instead and also you know get myself together in the carretera na holanda <laughs> on the road of netherlands because i never drive before and i really am planning to um, buy or lease a car soon so i have to you know get in the routine of the traffic here and everything and all the rules. So anyway, I'm going to keep on driving. Bye bye. If we talk about anything, girl, let's talk about us. Other ways, I wanna fall in love. This is me, Coco. Per, per, we made it. We made it after a whole shenanigans on the road of Netherlands, but we made it. We're a professional on the road, okay? Per. But anyway, right now, we are at Beautology. We're going to do a makeup look. So admire me, Demi Hombre something. And uh, we're going to see the after soon. All the ways I wanna be to trust. Four Balenciaga, all black Stretch Bugatti and it's sitting on me Oh, something like that Got me running like track Freak like me, got me bent in my back not to be wiped up but anyway i love my makeup thank you to this beautiful girl thank you so so much a whole ecstatic in the studio also we vibing and shit i love it wow 
Para mí que se abre limpio y blue. Se abre, se abierde. Se ve. <risa> to get this done because this is not nice we have to fix this real quick i also um posted a poll on my insta so y'all can vote which design to go for i should go for because i couldn't choose and the one that was mostly voted that one i'm going to do and i show y'all at the end which one it was and most probably you have to follow me on insta so you can join on these polls and everything so yes that's what we're going to do right now and then after i have school and then later i will have um i want to go to the gym oh, i want no i'm going to the gym so yeah i'm starting on a whole fitness journey i'm logging in all my calories everything that i eat daily and everything but i update y'all because i'm already here and also i'll give an update how the driving here in Netherlands went but I'll talk to y'all later these are my new babes my new set of nails y'all I'm in love I'm so in love it's so simple and the shade the shade is everything i love it the color everything i just live for the type these type of colors but anywho um i wanted to give an update on two things right what was one of them one of them was of, of course one of them for sure was me yesterday driving in the netherlands my first time experience it was amazing um, I was a, I was a little bit nervous at first because um, it was only me in the car. I had to pick up my mom in Schiedam, and then I had um, I had to have to um, beautology to do my makeup, and then drop my mom off at home, and then ride also back home by myself. So it's kind of it kind of was like driving by myself, and I and also have any company or some some but to start with i have to drive to ski down by my own damn self for the first time and i was nervous i was nervous and excited at the same time it was an unforgettable experience and also i really loved it i enjoyed it to the max and when i had to drop my mom off back home and then right back home by myself i it was a drive like i it, the drive was really easy i drove back as i was driving by myself like decades already in the netherlands i don't know how it was super easy the um, highway is the most easiest thing um if you have to drive like inside we call it binnen binnenweg so the inside roads then it will be a little bit more difficult because you have to watch so much things besides the traffic and the traffic lights you have to watch out for trams people bicycles um like a whole bunch of things a whole bunch of unnecessary things but it was really easy though i I am so ready to get my own car right now because I want to do it more often. But I think before I get my own car, I'm going to rent a car and drive like longer roads or something and see if I'm just capable to do that. But I think I'm most capable of doing it. I just love it. It was an amazing experience. And 
for me it was a super big step because it was the first time that i did it here in the netherlands and at first i had like anxieties about it because you have to watch too much th too much things but yeah i did it i did it it was an unnecessary anxiety and i'm so proud of my damn self so if you're also hesitating to drive here in the netherlands just to rent a car out if you want if you don't want to drive by yourself go with a person and just do it you will definitely love it and be really um excited or yeah you will be really you will love it and you will be definitely so happy that you did it you know but anyway i don't know what the other update was to be honest i really don't know if i recall then i turn turn on back the camera and do it i don't know ciao oh yes yo no then i, I remember i remember so um finally i gave in again it's like i'm excited to do so much new things this isn't exactly new but i have a motivation to just to work on my body goals and the motivation is extreme i've been um not procrastinating but i've been saying like for two months already that i really want to go to the gym so bad and finally i just subscribe to a gym and become a gym member so i can work on this body and also i'm trying to eat healthier so i'm calculating and logging in all my um foods that i consume daily in an app um but i think later on during the process i will do a separate video talking about all the apps that i use what i eat um, my journey how it's going before and after results like in a month or whatever it is i'm just going to you know film each and every process of the way so y'all can see definitely the results because i'm so motivated and when i'm motivated especially to work my ass off in the gym i will grind my ass off in the gym if i'm not motivated then i will definitely not do it but this time i'm so motivated i recall like a few years ago i was super motivated and my body was banging but i don't know what happened after that i just gave up i guess but this time when i start reading results seeing results that's when i'm just going to go harder so we're going to get there and later i think in like two hours or less i'm just heading to the gym and y'all will join me along on my first day back to the gym to achieve an amazing body goal so i'm so excited i'm so excited but anyway um right now i'm just going to get something to eat because i have to consume all the calories um in a day so i'm trying my best y'all and i didn't eat even eat like nothing i only had a um cheese ham croissant and an iced tea and that was it but i have to eat something right now because i'm so hungry so yeah let's see what we're going to get we are ready for the gym this is the fit this top is by gymshark and let me try to show y'all in the back it's like that it's like crossing just in the back kind of and this shirt is by pre i find it really good because it snatched the body like in its place that needs to be snatched so i like it so so much but i'm going to order a few shorts and also bottom parts by gymshark or any of those um active wear stores because i have a full set that's also by gymshark in the color cream but the bottom part because i lose a little bit of weight right on my crotch area it's a little bit uh-uh i don't like that no like i want it snatched i don't want it to like you know i don't know how to explain but i, I tried okay it's a little bit loose that's the word it's a little bit loose right on my crotch area and i like that so yes and also i have my vapor max with some socks by h&m Tomorrow, I think I'm going to buy some activewear at H&M. Uh, I don't know if we have like active stores, 
but I think, yeah, they, there's a few, but I will see what I'm going to buy. But I want something that snatch my waist like this and a whole part of the body, you know. And it also gave you the motivation to go to gym because gym will be like, I'm going to rock this outfit, fashion sense in the gym, per. So this is the wear and I'm going to throw on this oversized shirt just for now because it's a little bit cold outside. And also, when it gets a little bit hot, I'm just going to throw it out. <laughs> so, but yes, because it's a little bit cold outside. So, I'm just going to throw this on for now. And let's go. All right, it's about time that we start. Um, we're going to warm up first. machine that thing is killer and it was only 10 minutes damn Ooh. let's continue Day. I just finished eating my chicken and I'm also with my personal photographer. Hi! <laughs> it's been weeks since I've been back in the Netherlands and I didn't saw him for nothing. Like, what's happening? But anyway, finally we met up and we're going to take some pictures and make some content for y'all. I'm so excited. I bought three outfits and uh, I also want to do a transition of the different heels that I got for my insta reel also the outfits that I got for gym and also take pictures in three different outfits so a bunch of things in one day in a few hours but we're gonna make it sure so I'll check in my job during mid or session or when we're done Tem um blood de frio aqui. Ó. <laughs> ah, de um gol. Cabo salvo, cabo salvo, cabo salvo. Bum. Não há aqui. Vou tomar um chiqui. Oh my gosh. So right now we are waiting for the tram. We are done at this location. So we just are in Centrum of the hay um i think i post right there and right now we are heading back to the hay central and grab a tram and then head to world trade center hopefully we can get inside because they have an escalator there 
perfect for pictures the aesthetic perfect and also there is a hotel there and another spot that I've been eyeing for a while so we're going to make that happen around there so yeah how is it going so far it's in there. It's in there. <laughs> how's, how's the photographer lifestyle you like it, Bogus? So, 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 Let's grab the tram. The time has come to take down the Christmas tree. So that's what I'm starting with. I'm going to put all the ornaments in this block or the houses. And then the balls, I'm going to put them in a container. And um, all these, only the real gifts I will keep. And all of the fake gifts, I'm going to throw away. And the whole tree, I don't know if I'm going to keep it because I don't have a place to store it in. So I think I'm just going to give it away or put it outside for someone to grab it. But my ornaments are definitely going to be put away for next year. I put all the balls or the ornaments in here in these two containers. I bought these containers at Actions. And right now I'm going to get rid of the Christmas light. And also the Christmas light came already with its own little container. So I'm just going to put that in there. And then I'm going to just put the Christmas tree outside. So somebody that really wants it, they can just take it away. Okay, so this is going to be a challenge, but we're going to do it. Okay, this is my light, and this is the Christmas light. Okay. I don't know where to start, to be honest. Let me get rid of the blanket. I also had this one, so I'm <laughs> going to put it on the side. Oh, I'm washing also my clothes, so let me see real quick if the if they are done because I think it's been a while. I had to quickly run and uh, grab my clothes in the washing machine because they were done. So yeah, right now we are going to handle with this. I don't know where to start. I really don't know. We're going to try. <laughs> it's a struggle. Oh, yeah. Okie dokie. So. 
problems. We are definitely done with the Christmas tree. Does this thing fit? It's too tight in here. But we're gonna make it fit. Yes, we are totally done with the Christmas tree. I'm going to put it outside and get organized a little bit in the house because right now the house is a little bit messy with everything all over the place. So, yes! because I just finished editing a tutorial on a wash and go that I had collabed with the working formula in my previous vlog I already talked about her products so these two I'm just going to remind you this one this is the hair smoothie and also the tame and restore oil is an extreme growth scalp solution and this one is a deep conditioner Condi <laughs> deep conditioning hair mask can't talk for nothing and i just finished filming the um video probably when the vlog is up it's going to be up the day after so the video of the tutorial is going to be uploaded the day after on my instagram reel if not then it's already posted so make sure to check it out and also follow me on instagram and also go and give the working formula a follow and test out their products because I just tested out the Extreme Sculpt Growth. That thing has a tingly sensation out of the world. The sensation, when you feel the sensation in your head, you know it's going to work. You know the vibes. So I'm already amazed by it. Right now I have the hair smoothie in my hair. I'm going to leave it on for one hour and then I'm going to wash it out and style my hair as usual. And when I style my hair, I'll show y'all and also let y'all know how my hair feels and everything. So make sure to follow the working formula and also watch out, watch the tutorial on how I used these two products in my hair. So yeah, so right now I'm just going to quickly grab my towel because it's I'm getting cold, you know, filming and not be able to be running the hot water in this cold weather. The bathroom is already cold, like it's not going and you can hear my voice, I'm a little bit sick, I have a flu, I've been sick for like three days already, but right now I'm feeling way better. Yesterday, because I was feeling so sick and I'm so tired, I didn't go to the gym, but today for sure I'm heading to the gym when I'm done with my hair. I think I'm just going to put my hair like in a knot or something and just head to the gym and then finish styling my hair i don't know we will see or in a pineapple puff we will see what's going to happen with the hair because i don't want to sweat my freshly washed hair that's for sure so that's what i wanted to update you all on and i'll meet you tomorrow if not in the gym tomorrow i'm going to meet up Finally with Christine, we're going to meet up again and we're going to have a full blown out content day So of course, I'm bringing y'all along with me. So See ya later alligator <laughs> I told y'all today I'm with Christine. We're back! Look at her and look at our new baggage <laughs> because we have to change like outfits real quick. We are at Stathuis Rotterdam and this is my outfit. Girl, let me show them my outfit real quick. Yes. Ooh. This is my outfit, y'all. Wait, we need some sun, girl. Come, yeah, come, come. Look at the sun today, guys. 
This is outfit number two, y'all. So I have this set and with these heels. This is a blazer. Firm. Firm. This is Christina again in her second outfit. She has this trench coat with those high boots. Oh, how can you walk in that? How? Yeah. It's just for pictures because you cannot walk in that shit. You can't. In the meantime, I'm just comfy with my stilettos. <laughs> Alright, Amores. So, me and Christine are at... What is this place called? We're at Sapporo Ramen Kitchen. Rotterdam. <laughs> yes. She brought me here. I don't even think it's that the it's best. Safe, like, it's the best. It's my first time that I'm going to test the ramen here. So, wish me luck, y'all. And also, wish me luck with these chopsticks. Because... <laughs> I don't, I don't know, like, let me try to. <laughs> How are you supposed to hold this thing? I Wait. have no clue, girl. Wait. Ciao. I think because we have nails, it's like... I'm just going to ask for it. Yeah. It's not gonna work out. Look at the ceiling, guys. And we ordered some homemade iced tea. Cheers! Mm, it's very homemade. It's very homemade, yes. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> 